Hey guys, I'm getting ready to head in here and start painting a piece of furniture. But before I do paint, I'm going to prep it. And so whenever you want to prep your furniture, sometimes if it's dirty, you need to give it a good cleaning. Um, a lot of times if I've had a piece of furniture that has been at a thrift store or been sitting in storage, sometimes it needs a good cleaning with just some good cleaner. This piece of furniture the homeowner has had in the house, it's not very dirty at all. So I'm going to go straight to sanding with just a light uh, a 220 grit sanding sponge and just to kind of lightly rough up the surface um, and then I'll clean off that dust and I can go straight to painting. Okay, so I sanded all of the furniture and now I'm going to use the tack cloth just to get the dust off. And gotten all the dust off and all of these drawers if you can see have these little edges around them so this part of the project is going to be the tedious part and I'm going to start with it now but this makes it so much better my pretty clear cut this is my favorite brush y'all to paint with um, so these have stiff nylon polyester bristles which are really good for cutting in so this is great when you're working on trim as well um, but it also comes in different sizes. So I have the 2.0, but it comes in a bigger brush and a smaller brush depending on your project. So this has been my favorite paint to use on furniture because we also use it on like cabinets when size painting kitchen cabinets and things, but it's the Emerald line at Sherwin-Williams, the urethane trim enamel, interior, exterior. We used a satin finish in black, but this stuff goes on so good and it's super durable. So I cut in with my pretty clear cut um, brush and now I'm going to roll on all the smooth surfaces. My favorite uh, roller to use is this Jumbo Ultra Finish in a 3 8 inch nap. It's for ultra smooth finishes. You can use it with all paints and finishes. And so I'm going to use my pretty roller frame and tray and I'm going to start rolling and this is going to give me a super, super finish, uh, smooth finish on my furniture. So this paint is good and dry, and now I'm using my same roller. I'm gonna put a second coat on, and this should totally be enough. It's gonna dry really good to a good hard finish, and it will be as smooth as glass. Okay, these are the little knobs that were on this dresser, and there are a ton of them. And I am going to use Gold Leaf Rub and Buff um, on these and just rub them on there so they'll have gold hardware which will be really pretty against the black. Um, I'm using this paintbrush to put it on but I'll be honest I wouldn't be surprised if I end up using my finger because sometimes it's a lot quicker but we will see. <laughs> 